in the early years of following God, because we were brought up very meticulously with this understanding of you have to do something to please God. We fasted. We prayed. We cried. We shed tears as if that was going to impress God. And I prayed and prayed and prayed. I went from conferences to conferences seeking how to have a very sustainable experience of God. And as I went from one meeting to another, I met preachers whom I believe were very sincere. And I asked him, I asked them, I said, Sir, what can I do to be victorious? And they gave me several steps. Do this, do this, don't do this again, do this. If you do that, stop this. I said, all this I've been doing, but I don't know. They said, keep trying. And I did all of that for several years, frustrated. One day, I said, Jesus, if you cannot save me, let me go back to where I'm coming from. If there is no assurance that you have power to save a man and save him to the uttermost. And I was ready to finish it that day. I prayed. But to my greatest surprise. I only heard him say. It is finished. Say, what is finished? How can you say it is finished when I'm still here? I'm struggling. I cannot forget that day when I opened my Bible and the first thing that fell there is said, know you not that you are dead? No, no, no. I said, no, that's a mistake. Because all that we knew is that you, will, you should die. Kill yourself. Kill it. Our most celebrated preacher said, kill the old man. Then you'll be victorious. So, we were always, Lord, kill me. Kill me. I want to die. I will die. Kill me. In the name of Jesus. Only for me to now come and stumble at the word of God and say, you are dead. I said, no, that's wrong. That's wrong. That version is wrong. So I threw the version away. I look for another version. And that version makes it more serious. Say, you have died. <laughs> ah. Then I went to other versions. I was looking for one that would say, you should die. Or you will die. I was looking for that. But I read and read and read. Only to realize that something was finished. You are dead. Then I said, when? When did I die? That was a big issue for me. And I read and read and read. Said those who belong to Christ Jesus, they have. Oh, brothers, if I could impress upon you, start reading your Bible properly. 